Serbia is uh, not very enthusiastic, but we are still committed towards our EU path because we don't see the real alternative to that path. And uh, that's of an utmost significance for Serbian people, for Serbian state. But, you know, uh, we are on that path for already 20 years. I think, apart from Turkey, not a single country have been waiting so many years. So why do you see that you're having to wait so long then? Well, it's geopolitics always. Some people might say that there were a lot of our mistakes, but I would agree with you saying that uh, it was mainly because of Belgrade-Pristina relationship. But at the same time, even today, I discussed that not only with European officials, but with Mike Pompeo as well. And I asked him, OK, even if we do that arrangement with Pristina, if you find a compromising solution, whether that would be enough or not to join the European Union and uh, none of people from EU or even from US, because they were cooperating closely to each other, couldn't confirm that we would be a part of EU. It means that we need to wait a decision and uh, a conclusion of European Union, whether they want to see Serbia as a part of European Union or not. But there will come a point, where they're not, when you're going to actually have to decide whether it's going to be Moscow or the EU. You always say you can straddle both, but EU membership does actually ask for an alignment in terms of foreign policy. You know what's your problem? Your problem and the problem of most of the Western media is that they have a pattern. Well, you have a good relationship with Moscow. Yes, I have. And we have. And we'll carry on with that. Because that's for the benefit of Serbian people. And that's for the benefit of our country. And at the same time, I always say to Putin, and I don't hide it, like many other politicians from European Union, because when they see Putin, they forget where they come from. I say to him that we are on our EU path. That's our strategic path. That's our strategic goal. But it doesn't mean even when we become an EU member state that will shut all our ties or uh, stop all our links with Russia or with China or with all the others. And to tell you the truth, I'm fed up of uh, being lectured and uh, taught by all the others about our cooperation with China and Russia. And then I see all the others meeting Xi Jinping and uh, Putin even more often than I do. You know, do your job. You're a sovereign state. Serbia is a sovereign state. We do everything that is by far the best for our people and for our country. And at the same time, we have always been together with Europeans on all difficult issues. And uh, there are no... Uh, false or difficult choices for us because that's our strategic way but we don't know whether we're going to be a part of European Union within three years, five years or seven years. We'll keep all our ties for the sake of our people and that's our politics.